Alrighty, so I'm Muffins, and I'm going to do a little playthrough of GTA 3, and I'm going to let the cinematics roll just so everything is uh, kosher or whatnot, so uh, here we go. Liberty City is in shock today as the police and emergency services deal with the aftermath of a devastating attack on a police convoy this morning. As yet, no details have been released about the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarters databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. Come on! Senor Dickhead! It's no problem to kill you. You're gonna be sorry. Aye, aye, get lost. place to the edge of the red light district where we can lay low. But my hands are all messed up. So you better drive, brother. Alrighty, here we are. Alright, so let's go to our new shack. Or let's fix the audio first. Much, much better. Wow, bring back some memories. I haven't seen this stuff in years. I remember the first time I played this game. I must have been 12 years old and I thought, this is the best game that has ever been made. I played this game till kingdom come. I never, ever stopped. I played this game all day and my parents got to the point where they told me you have to stop playing because I would just sit on the computer for hours and hours. I always wanted to go in there and see what was inside, look around. Might have to do some adjusting with the uh, audio and whatnot, but for right now, I think this is fine. It is so sad that I've played this game so much, I know exactly where I'm going, and I don't have to look at all. Wait here. 
here, man, while I go in and talk to Luigi. Paul's got some business upstairs. Well, maybe you could do me a favor. One of my girls needs a ride, so grab a car and pick up Misty from the clinic, then bring her back here. Remember, no one messes with my girls. So keep your hands on the wheel. If you don't mess this up, maybe there'll be more work for you. Now get out of here. You know that cutscene that I, uh, or not the cutscene, but that, that, uh, entrance, little, uh, cinematic thing that I, uh, went through during the beginning of my video? That was the first time I'd ever watched it. All those years I'd been playing this game, I had never seen the beginning. I never knew there was any kind of, like, bank robber or arrest or anything like that. Oh, shit. I used to love this radio, because when I was a kid my parents never let me listen to any music besides rock, so hearing anything besides rock was like the best thing in the world for me. Alright, so let's just do another mission. <sighs> Don't spank my bitch up. Luigi said to to give you this, so here, here, take it. There's a new guy on the street. Goes by the name of Spank. Some wise guy has been introducing this trash to my girls down Portland Harbor. Go and introduce a bat to his spank. Then take his car, respray it. I want compensation for this insult. I always like the uh, voice actors in this. I always thought they were hilarious. Hopefully that's a little better. Hopefully you can hear a little bit more of the uh, world. I completely forgot where this guy is. I've played this game through maybe maybe 20, 30 times, and I still can't remember. Uh, I know I remember what we're doing. Going here by the dogs. I'll just kill this motherfucker right here. I don't need to hit him with a bat. Where are you going? Bitch! Fuck you. I remember hating this car and like hating the way it handled. But it's the nicest thing you can get, I think, in this part of town. Or or at least there's that car dealership you can get a better car. Besides that, you can't really get anything nice until you unlock another part of the city. Now the graphics are pretty shitty, but I mean, I think this game came out in 2001, so for 2001 this had really great graphics. There's no wonder this game was so successful. I remember playing this game all the time, and I got to know all the little glitches, all the little places in the map to go to like drive your car like in a straight line to go really, really fast. I found out ways how to like, you know, get to the uh, get to the other island without unlocking them and all the, all that other stuff. Shit, shit, shit.
Oh yeah. And then I remember the next game that I played after this was um it was a long time after that and all the other all the other GTAs started had already like big GTAs had come out already besides GTA 4. Uh, San Andreas was already out when I started playing this. So the next game that I played was uh, Liberty City Stories. I think that was only available on console, I think PS2. And I remember thinking I was going to have to learn the whole like all the whole like islands again, but everything was exactly the same. And I thought the game was great, but apparently everyone hated that game. So let's start the next mission. Island on a combo. What am I gonna do? Wait. Hey, 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 I gotta talk to you. All right, Mick. I'll talk to you later. How you doing, kid? The Don's son, Joey Leon. He wants some action from his regular girl, Misty. Go pick her up at Hepburn Heights, but watch yourself. That's Diablo turf. Then run her over to his garage and threaten and make it quick. Joey ain't the kind you keep waiting. Remember, this is your foot in the door. So keep your eyes on the road and off Misty. When I first started playing this game, I had never left the state that I live in, and I thought, like, this must be exactly what New York looks like. And I had no idea how big this city was. But, uh, a little quick tip quickie there. How do I break this? Now we gotta wait for this bitch to stroll her way over here. I love the driving mechanics in this game. So much easier than like GTA 4. It was always crashing into shit. GTA 4. Hell, I always crash into shit now, but it's way, way better. Way, way easier. We gotta drive him over to that kid who's gonna give us some missions. He works in like a little garage or whatever. Joey's Auto Painting. I always wanted to drive the cool cars he had in here. I don't think I ever get the chance, or maybe I do. I don't remember. Joey! Am I gonna get to play with your big ends again? I'll be with you in a minute, Spark Plug. God, that woman's voice is agonizing. Hey, I'm Joey. Luigi said you were reliable, so come back later. There might be some work for you. All right? I always loved how the guy never said a word. Not one word was said. Alright, so uh, this is gonna be, I'm gonna call it, this is gonna be the first part of my little let's play. And uh, not too exciting, I know, I know. And uh, this is pretty much one of my first videos on my channel. I'm just starting out, so I hope you enjoyed the video. There'll be plenty to come. So thanks for watching, and see you around.